Hey guys, it's your boy Mark back with another video here to continue my Life of Strange playthrough series with part 11. Uh, I did say I was going to film part 11 right after I did uh, ep uh, part 10, but um, I went to have something to eat because it's 7 a.m. over here. Yes, guys, I've been up all night. Uh, so I might actually finish this game today, but still record each part individually, you know? I might upload every part tonight, to be honest with you. And, uh... Well, today's March the 8th. That's cool. Um... And yeah, and you see it says, please reconnect your... Dial, dial, do, the DualShock 4 wireless controller or your PlayStation Vita system. That's cause I was kinda like just leaving my system on, you know? But, uh... Yeah, oh by the way guys, uh, WWE just announced Wrestlemania 36 for April 5th, 2020, and that's freaking awesome. I love the Wrestlemania 36 logo so much. They did announce what the logo was, and I absolutely adore it. It's like a pirate themed logo, and it reminds me so much of when I was about 8 years old, there was this place in Wellington. New Zealand, of course, called Potty, uh, called uh, Pirates Cove. It was like a mini golf, pirate themed mini golf, and it was awesome. And that's what this logo reminds me of. It's so awesome. You got like a sword, also a flag, and WrestleMania. Like a, it's a, it's a whole pirate theme, you know, for WrestleMania 36's logo. And I absolutely adore it. This might honestly be my favorite. This was just today that they announced this and showed the. Uh, logo for next year's WrestleMania, and it might honestly be my favorite um, WrestleMania logo of all time. To be honest with you, I'm dead serious. They just uh, revealed the logo today, March 7th, 2019, in US time, but March 8th for me in New Zealand, of course. And I, I love it so much. Like I said, it probably is my favorite WrestleMania logo of all time. And, uh... Oh, fuck. There was, there was one more thing I was gonna say. I fucking forgot what I was gonna fucking say. Fucking pisses me off when that shit happens. It's really infuriating me right now. But, uh... Fuck. Whatever, man. Shit. Um... Just to keep it the way I did it the last couple times. Let's exit to main menu before we continue. Hey guys, it's your boy Mark here to continue. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, so that's how we always start these off. Life is Strange episode 11. I met you, man. Let's go. through all that again I won't wait Jefferson couldn't handle stains on his photos good now I can use them I'd really like to smash that fancy camera into Jefferson's face okay I broke those files when I kicked the trolley whoa I I'm definitely more awake in this photo I could try this one. This might work. Please work. Oh, 
I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? <laughs> Max, I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment. Innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura. And those lucky few become my models. My subjects. Yes. You're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. And don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. You killed Chloe. You murdered my best friend. She had a loaded weapon. This was clearly self-defense, but that's what happens when you play with guns. Or try to fuck with me. It's better when they don't know. Like pure, sweet Kate. Blah, blah, blah. God, I hate your voice now. You might as well savor it, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. <laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. When you told the principal that I made Kate cry, I thought you almost had me. It's good our esteemed Principal Wells is like most administrators. A closet drunk. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. You used Nathan. I prefer the term manipulated, like with an image. Nathan's was easy to twist around. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune, who do you think paid for this glorious dark room and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so... Look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Holy. Do you finally get it now, Max? 
I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, now this one. That's why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to... With a heart, a heart. What am I supposed to do? What the heck? Okay. Wait! Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. You... you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. Oh, oh, oh my, oh, that's right. Oh man, I remember now. Look at that shot. Yeah, I'm gonna do exactly. Oh my God. I can go all the way back to the moment this all started. Max, this could be your chance to fix everything for good. Full circle, right? Full circle. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. I feel like that's the first time the C word, the word cunt, has been used in a in a playthrough of mine that isn't from myself, but from a character actually in the game, you know? And capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word I'm back. for a wonderful photographic trick. Right back where I started this insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever again. Portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. <laughs> Who cares? This class is hella bullshit. I'll pretend you didn't say that and let you try to answer mm -hmm. one more. Sorry, there's no time left. I mean, your class is almost over. Oh. Well. Thanks for the warning. So, the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. Clearly, Max doesn't have the, uh, time. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. Time to change time. The winter to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the First, Army. let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. Get it together. Taylor, don't hide. 
I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. This diary literally saved my life. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Found you. Five 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 six three zero eight two four three six three zero eight four five 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 six three zero. All right, five 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 six three zero eight two four three five 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 six three zero. Eight four eight two four three eight two. Eight two four three eight two four three eight two four three. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else, and take Jefferson down fast. Oh, it doesn't look like I got a. Oh, cool. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? Yeah, you probably are. Hi, Kate. Oh, hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Thanks. You always know the right thing to do. Oh, Rachel. I'm sorry. I can't wait to to see what the Rachel characters actually like, you know, talking and stuff. And being around her in Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't wait to play that shit, my ninja. I see right through your bullshit, Jefferson. Everybody else will too. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh. Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? I can see you're kissing ass again. Nothing new. What did you just say? Hold on, Victoria. <laughs> Are you okay, Max? Not until Victoria knows that hiding behind a screen and posting videos of people is totally fucked up. You know how easy it is to hurt somebody? To destroy their life? Are you proud of yourself? If you have any feelings left, you should think about your actions. Listen, I, I didn't... Of course you did. You're so insecure, you can't even be happy with your own town. You have to try and bring everybody down to your mean and ugly level. Okay, I do not have to listen to this bullshit. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? Well, it looks like you already did, Victoria. <laughs> Then, I guess I'm done talking. I sure hope so. I'm not going to say I didn't enjoy that, but... Why? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No. It wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh... I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very... Happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be innocent. Or guilty. Uh, well, thanks for the photo. And 
Maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. That was badass, Max. That was badass. I mean, what? I think it's saying the rest of the week didn't really change is what it's saying. Oh, except for that. Taylor, Kate, and El Alyssa. I did everything right this time. Good work, David. Fix shit. Sorry for spoiling. But uh oh man, we're gonna have to go back in time again soon. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time. <laughs> when we were innocent. I can't mm -hmm. wait to land in Frisco beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Uh, nobody calls it Frisco, so please don't. It's so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. Excuse me, sir. I have to admit, I love being called an artist. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited to. Fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so excited, too. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. It's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, Things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco, but we all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. Christ, 
Another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. Man, if I did all this, I would have no idea what the fuck to do. <laughs> like in real life, I mean. Francisco is so cool, and this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Work the room. I don't know. I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max. After this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm gonna eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. Wow, Sir Max. You did it. Somehow. I went from the dark room to this gallery. I've been through so many realities in one week. Life is weird. His work is going to be worth serious cash. I guess I have to get used to the idea of fancy food I don't want to eat. Young and grunge. He'll think about those days for the rest of his life in prison. Good. Black, I do not understand art. How much would you pay for that? That is different. Loving the retro vibe. Me too. Makes me want to go buy an instant camera. Damn, I bet that film costs a Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least, for today. A second. You're I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. High altitude. Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, come on. Please answer. Holy shit, man. Your vision. It's true. You saw the tornado. It's coming. What? Oh, no. Chloe, where are you? Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Oh my 
God. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is going to be destroyed. Uh, unfortunately. There has to be a way to stop this. For good. Arcadia Bay being destroyed is inevitable, though. I want to search that up. I want to search up Life is Strange. No fucking way. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. How do these galleries afford to rent here? This makes me feel so Fuck, sad. man, if I do this, I'd be so fucking... Oh, man. I could have done this so much better. You Excuse guys... me, I'd love to ask you a few questions about your work. Sorry, but... Oh... Uh... Man, I would be so fucking... Uh, for lack of better words, if I had to do that. You know, if I had those towels and stuff. What am I doing to time? I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. Oh no, I don't want to do it. Fuck it. I wonder what it'd be like if you died in like a different reality, bro. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Mm, oh, fuck. That's what I'd be like. Back to the dark room? How? How do she get back to the dark room? Fuck me. I haven't played this game in nearly two years, remember guys? Before this play. Fuck! God no! I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything! What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. Eat shit and die, cunt. Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. That's actually an inside joke, by the way, guys. Hey. When I said eat shit and die, cunt. Holy shit, what the fuck? You're... What the fuck? That caught me off guard, man. Who was this bleeding? Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He burned my diary. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something. Did you see his eyes? Weird out going on with you. Fuck. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said. Something. <laughs> 
Uh oh. All right, she's still called David. There's that fear. Oh. Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Please, don't do this. Man, oh, man. I promise, this final dose won't hurt. What? Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody in Blackwell did. Right, Max? Okay. Let's try this one last time. No more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I... Can I please ask you for one last... request? Oh... You got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Uh, excuse me, but... My, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. This final dose won't hurt. What? David still comes at the exact same time that the needle is about to go into Max's neck though. I just... The, the, that doesn't... I don't think that makes any sense because he came in when he came in, you know, and that talk of Max and stuff and about... and when he went to get a glass of water, that would have taken up time, like... Probably during the time that he was going to get the glass of water. David probably would have come in, you know you know what I mean? I hope you know what I mean. David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? What? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? No gun, no balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. No! David Madsen, of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. A real bullet. It's over. You are not going to stop me. Going to stop me. He's hiding a gun over there. Sorry, Madsen. Is this this is brutal, man? It's over. Grab your gun now. Got it. Oh. 
You are not going to stop me. Grab that bottle! Suck. So Over. You are not going to stop me. Oh, Lord, Max. Are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Hmm. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Missed the one photo lift. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson, but you won't need this anymore. Now, what the hell is this place? I better go outside and call Warren. Oh, please answer. Jefferson looks so pathetic now. All this expensive gear just for it's a studio. sick bullshit. I can still feel those straps. Stop, Max. You're free. Oh, I want to burn all the hate looking at me like that. Damn. Jefferson torched everything. Now the only photo I can get is the one Warren took. Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. The Prescott's had to know about this. Jefferson had plenty of women who would have totally posed for him. But he didn't want to give his subjects a choice. You won't be going, Jefferson. To any more shows. Max, I'm sorry. No one would have looked for Nathan's body with this. Sorry you had to be here. Looks like Jefferson was planning a major security renovation with Prescott Cash. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. It's a studio. David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was going to kill me. You got here just in time. I'm glad. I always suspected that son of a bitch. I never did. Until too late. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. Well, you still had the right idea to tell the principal that Jefferson acted shady around Kate Marsh. And Max, I treated Kate like shit. I know she's a good person, but I'm not. I hope I get to tell her that soon. Kate was bullied up to that roof, but it was still Nathan and Jefferson who put her there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel and...
Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No, I, I should have told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and, and almost used it. I put the school in danger. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while well, you had each other. Maybe she learned from you. I think she only learned how to hate my guts. <laughs> you both had a tough start. And I know it wasn't easy. I'm not gonna make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but... I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but... When Joyce kicked me out... I had nothing. I'm so sorry about that. I didn't want that to happen. I should never have set up those surveillance cams. Who kept all those files. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she... She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. And I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but... Maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. <laughs> so, where is Chloe? David... Uh, Chloe is... is... dead. This isn't happening. He can't... No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you... are you sure? Are you... Yes, I... I saw her. I... I saw a... Jefferson killer in the junkyard. Last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room. I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I God damn it! You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! David, wait! Max. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe. I'm sorry. Joyce. I failed you. My family. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max. You better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David, I... Thank you... for saving me. Oh my God.
What do I tell Joyce? What? I've seen so many people die this week. Now Jefferson. I feel numb. I've seen people... Well, not in real life. I haven't seen people die before in I person. lost again. They always lose. In person, I mean, I, I've seen, I haven't seen people die. I've seen people die on like best score and stuff, but not real, not, but not in person. And I don't want to see that in person. Why can't yeah. I just wake up? Let this be a nightmare. I can't believe Jefferson is dead. I can't believe Jefferson is dead. You killed my Chloe. Hold tight, David. I'm going to fix everything. Hey, I detect a little bit of symbolism there. Look at that bullet I in wish the. I could keep killing you forever. Bullet hole in the thing, in the forehead of that girl in the portrait. That's like I feel like that's symbolic of that. Jefferson's whole thing in this dark room is over. It's dead. And he's dead right well. My nose. That would have depended if I had uh, killed him one uh got him got David to kill him or not. Or or told David the truth, you know. Oh this part's gonna end soon. took last night in the parking lot. Yeah. Why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thinks this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think the storm is getting smaller. It's okay, me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. striking us down and I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station somebody get me the hell out of here now now God and how I pay all those taxes you have one new message message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max it's, it's Nathan I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. Sorry.
All right, guys, I'm gonna have to end this part right here. This is part 11, right? Yeah, part 12 is up next. Could be the final part, honestly. And I'll be kind of relieved about that, honestly. Oh, that song they played at the end was beautiful. I gotta search that song up. I just came up with an idea for a movie with that song. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, gonna exit to the main menu. Uh, let's just reload just to test it out. Reload, my boy. I like how that song only plays and continues when you're like doing a straight through, but if you re if you reload, it won't like do that. You know what I mean? I hope that makes sense. But anyway, um, this part's over now, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Can exit to the main menu. I'll film the next part right now. I'll probably upload all these parts tonight, honestly. Like, why not? You know? So yeah. Thanks for watching guys, Life is Strange Part 11, peace out.